How about this one, Pete? Roblox. We did have unusual activity in Roblox. Look at those. A couple of pretty big purchases. The stock popped as much as 14% in the pre. And what Pete and I pay attention to, folks, and all of our subscribers as well, is when we see unusual activity, um, if it's in calls, it's bullish. If it's in puts, bearish. Well, this was clearly bullish activity. One thing that I'm a little uh, degrading the stock because of this, Pete, but you know, most of their income comes from nine and 12 year old kids. Yeah. <laughs> well, you know, I, I guess parents give those kids money. Some of those kids probably have paper routes or whatever, but my yeah. gosh. To have a multi-billion dollar company hinging on uh, nine and 12 year old kids, uh, you know, that demographic, that's a little scary to me anyway. It is a little scary, John, but let's also face the facts. There's a heck of a lot of parents out there that use something other than themselves as parents for the kids. That's just the facts. It's the way it works. So the gaming side of this whole thing and everything that's that we, we look at, well, if you're nine to 12, you're probably pretty excited when your family says, oh, you know what? You want to just uh, you stay over there and just play some of these games. Daily active user users were up 22 percent year over year, John. So they really have shown everything that you would want to see. It's why the stock had a really nice move to the upside. Is it sustainable? Maybe. Who knows? But I can tell you this really close to the 52 week highs that got up there towards 46, 52 week, week highs, a little bit north of 47. This is a stock that when you look at their numbers, yeah, there's a small amount of shorts, so there is a little bit of a squeeze, but I'm actually going to not say it's about the squeeze. I think it's more about the numbers that they were able to put up this quarter. People were pretty excited about that, embraced that, and I think that's why that we're seeing the stock as close to the 52-week highs as it is right now. Can it go higher? It could, but I think for right now, this would be a good time to pause. Roblox, like I say, and Pete hit the nail on the head with the uh, not everybody parents correctly. That doesn't mean that we're ripping parents that might give their kids some money so they can go in there to Roblox and spend it. But if you're letting that be the uh, arbiter of uh, what your kid does with their spare time, uh, rather than just being a small part, if it's a really big part, well, maybe there's a problem.